Hi, it's Shana Blaze here. Join me on my podcast, Homestyle. We provide the ideas and inspiration you need for your home, DIY design projects and expert advice. Red Energy's podcast lifestyle series, available from wherever you get your podcasts and the SEN app. Matthew Lloyd's Top 7 for Kia's Sorento, Drive Car of the Year. Yeah, it's gotten so big as the top seven that uh, Lloydy is now very confident, Jared, that it's bigger than Yes No Richo. I've had people. I'm not saying it is. I've had people texting yep. in the ad break, hoping that they're on and demanding that they be on because I, they want their man. Their managers aren't doing a good enough job. I have Lloydy's people, about to put them on the map. I have people texting me on the weekend saying this would be a good idea for Lloydy's top seven. Right. I, I mean, it's taken off. And a player wasn't happy when I didn't have him in the marketable players. And he let, let you know about it as well? Yeah, he did. And yeah. I haven't told you who that player yeah, no, was. No, no, no. You haven't told me that. But he's got a big presence on, on Instagram. Mm. And um, fair to say, he wasn't wrapped. Anyway, <laughs> players who should move on for greater opportunity. It's This is going to get ton- tongues wagging as we head towards trade time. Go, yeah, you, go uh, ahead, Lou. Oh, I'm even naming one I couldn't fit in because I, I love this boy. But uh, Charlie Constable, he, mm. he's the eighth one. So he's not even in the top seven. But I hope a club gives him a chance next year. But number seven, Jerry. He's the first eighth Lord he's ever talked yes, about. Yes, yes. That is significant, Charlie. <laughs> you can't be doing that, though. You can't be adding to this. Well, we can oh, make okay. it a top eight. No, it's a seven. All right, number seven. Uh, 29 disposals, Tom Lynch on the weekend, and seven marks, yep. and he will make your football club better. Oh, A quality human being. Lordy, I don't know if there's room on Jaren's bandwagon. Oh, He's been talking about this for weeks. I just saw a headline come up. Fears that Federer has played his last game. He's 40. <laughs> and only, we're sacking. We're, is he only 40? There's a side at the bottom of the ladder sacking a bloke who's in their best 15 players. Anyway. Yep. Number six. Number six. Another great human being for your footy club and vice captain of the Western Bulldogs. Oh, Mitch, Mitch Wallace. Mitch Wallace. So nice. The Mitch Wallace file. Hasn't it turned, didn't it turn quickly for Mitch after such a great year last year? Number five. There's no room for Tom Lynch, Revolt, Coleman Jones, Nan Curvis. So this Marbior. man, Marbior. Oh, so you'd have Marbior at Richmond before Coleman Jones? Oh, uh, I think they've shown their hand that Jones, Coleman Jones is their man. I think he's more of a ruckman. Okay. Can I ask you, yeah. Lloydy, just getting a wrap up, a uh, wind up from Judd. Yeah. How much is child worth on the market? Judd man, calling the shot. In a pick or, or financially? Cash. Uh, oh, I'd say 300. Not, I'd, you get, oh, it, you get him cheap. So lo, lo, less than average. That, well, say, yeah, because he's not getting a game. Um, I'd say, yeah, 350 potentially, the average. Yep. N- number four. I'm a buyer at that price. Four is a, a Western Bulldog smooth mover who is Patrick Lipinski. Nice. Who I think would be good in another environment and yep. gets more opportunity. <laughs> Unbelievably, number three is a Western Bulldog player. So, Carey Grammer. Oh, I know. Red head off half back was Ed unbelievable. Richards, Ed, Ed Richards. I think he gets played out of position. Right. He should be. On a half back flank where Anybody they left at the dogs. Where they drafted him. <laughs> They're all playing for someone else next and year. And he's played in a half forward line. So as good okay. as Bevo is, I think he plays some players out of position. And he's one of them. Gee. Number two, the man that's always a sub at Geelong. Quinton. Quinton. Narkle? Yeah. Needs to run what? harder into the fence. Is there yes. another Quinton? <laughs> <laughs> so he's at number two. Give me uh, your number one. And number you? one. Uh I know he's got to improve. But uh, the man, Sam Wiedemann. No, he always looks after the full forwards. Yeah. He, you know, he, he's gonna he would be playing at What's about. What's he worth on the market? Oh, I think he's worth five in, in the fives to another team. I think someone will pay more than that. Gee. And oh, you're paying oh. Joel 300. I'm paying Joel more than 300. I reckon Joel's. I reckon you're unders by 200 I wish you two were my managers. Yep. But the way you're throwing money well, around. Lordy, the way, the way COVID's going, we're all going to have to, <laughs> <laughs> to add a few strings to our bows. I'm happy to manage you. Hmm. Happy to manage you, Jared, as well, if, you, if you're looking for representation. No. You manage me in a retirement, what? I think, <laughs> Couch is on tonight, eight. It's not folklore, it's fact that country footy brings local communities and its people together. Visit countryfootyscores.com.au. Delivered by Red Energy and TAC. Get your country footy fix and all the latest results at countryfootyscores.com.au. 30 on Fox, it's...